Yeah. 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 1075 the vibe. It's your boy Church TV. Welcome to the Power Circle, man. I got my man DJ B Dog. Give me the without DJ B Dog. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What's uh -oh. up, cuzzo? Ain't okay. nothing, man. Okay. We just had a. Well, we had boy, listen, man. We've been in here rolling for about three hours, man. Yes, sir. We had exclusive, though. Shout out to that boy AD, man. That was exclusive tonight. Shout out to AD McPherson. Shout out to Mel. What's happening, Mel? Got my girl Mel in the middle. What's happening? What's up, y'all? That was like awe inspiring. Yeah. You just see, yeah, like, yeah. the humbleness of this great athlete. Like, man, I tell you, Sarasota Bradenton, we out here. Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, our next guest in the building, two fellas that uh, have taken the 941 by storm. Manatee County. Y'all make sure y'all stand up on your other end of the phone <laughs> yeah. right now. <laughs> give a, stand give up. a round of applause. You understand me? And hey, big dog, we got the claps ready this time. Hey, we ready this time. <laughs> I got the owners of the Hot Box Express, Mr. Joe Morris. What's up, everybody? What's up? What's up? And Michael. Irving. Hey, oh, 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 damn. Hey, hey. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Pull the mic up a little bit. Okay. Oh, hey, man, brother, how y'all gonna come over here and sit down and not have the food? Man, where the food at? Where the food at? I told him, put it over there for a Okay. Okay. Hey, y'all gotta bring the food. Yeah, 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 yes, sir. Please, please, please bring the food, please, sir. Please bring the food. Hey, listen, man, I've been talking about this Hot Box Express. For a few weeks now, since I found yeah. out about these fellas, yeah. man, and yeah. uh, if you had Hot Boss Express, go ahead and tap in right now. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, tap in. Hey. Tap, in ain't tap in if you had the Hot Boss Express. You understand me? It's great food over there, Hot Boss Express, and it's black owned right uh, right here in our own community, right in Palmetto. So look. If you uh in Palmetto ever in Palmetto, oh Miss Lauren Heaven, I'm gonna tell you where they're located right now. If you are ever in Palmetto, next to the uh, no 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 in the plaza where Snappy's is and where T and T where T Green Barbershop and, and Tony Barbershop is, right two doors down next to the laundry mat, you will find the Hot Box Express. If you don't know where I'm talking about, it's right next to the Palmetto Youth Center, right next to the railroad tracks. You can't miss, you it. Can't miss it's it. In the plaza. In, in the, the plaza. plaza. Right there by T Green. Right Come there on. by T Green, the Snappy's <laughs> Plaza, now. man. Hot Box Express. All right, all right. Uh, first, first, can we look at this food that we got, Mr. Morris? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mr. Morris and Mr. Irving. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. what we got here? What we got here? Oh, shit! Ooh, whoa! It's the Southwest Nachos right here with the Southwest beef. Southwest beef nachos loaded. Southwest beef loaded. nachos fully loaded. 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 Fully I'm hungry, nice. fellas. I'm hungry. Nice three piece lemon pepper right there. Ooh. Ooh. You need all that? You want some quick? Ooh. Feel your belly high and ready. Okay, okay, yeah, so okay. Right. Yeah. That big dog yeah. in there, right? <laughs> okay, what we got here? What okay. we got next? Okay. What we got next? We got the uh, beef sub right here. Oh, the Ooh. beef sub. You know what I'm beef sub. They got beef, beef subs, subs over there, y'all. You know what I'm saying? With the fries. Well, hold on. What's Call on the beef the sub? Red. Okay. It's fully loaded. Fully loaded beef sub. Ooh. You can catch. Do you have smell of vision? Do you have smell of vision? <laughs> they ain't got it. They need it, boy. Yeah, hey, uh, shout out to Chef Tef. Chef Tef said she went to school with Joe, and I ain't know he could cook. That look good. Yeah. Okay. What we got here? Ooh. We got them eight piece. Eight That's piece. an eight piece or ten yes, piece or what piece? Uh, lemon piece. pepper dry rub. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Eight piece lemon pepper Ow. dry rub. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, woo! That's big dog right there. <laughs> oh, hey, big dog! <laughs> he turned up. He ready for the food. Okay, okay, icing on the cake. We got dessert. We got desserts. We got dessert. What is this? Fried Oreos right there. Fried Oreos with the food. Right here, year round. Every day with the funnel cake. Let them know that they ain't gotta wait till what. 
to the fam. Okay. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta okay. I gotta wait till eleven in the morning. We'll be right there. Okay. Okay. Get that Oreos, cake, Italian ice. Mm-hmm. It's all that. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, wait a minute. Time out. Time out. Time out. Julia. Julia. What's Julia? Julia. Explain what's a Julia. What's a Julia? Yeah. Yeah. What's a Julia? Yeah. Yeah. A, a, a frozen cup. Yeah. 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 Okay. A, a, a frozen cup. A flip. But we didn't call them Julius where I grew up. What y'all call them? What y'all call them? Lily Dillis. Lily Dillis. Yeah. Oh, we got to get into that. Lily Dillis. I heard somebody say that down south. Yeah. I said, what's a Lily Dillis, man? Yeah. He said, man, like, like you know, a freeze cup. I said, man, we call them the Julius. Julius. That's what I said. Julius. So, so, look, we got the Southwest Nachos here. Yes, yes, yes. We have the... Okay. Beef right. sub, loaded beef sub oh, with fries, oh, and they give you ranch and ketchup. We got fully loaded, high and ready. Eight piece of wings, Ooh. lemon pepper, ketchup, Ooh. and ranch are ready for you. And we also screenshot got that wings. right there, y'all. Screenshot that on your live right there. <laughs> screenshot it right get, now. now. Hot box you know express. The right there. Oh, and we got. Fried Oreo. Now, I ain't never had no fried, fried Oreo. Oreo. That's why I brought them for you. Remember you say you never had none? Yes, sir. So I'm going to bring you some? Yes, sir. There it is. There right it now. is. Uh, can I eat one of these fried Oreo? One of y'all want to start I, the interview? I want to try one of them. Yeah, 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 So, fellas, Mr. Morris, Mr. Irvin, how, uh, how did the Hot Box Express start while I tried this fried Oreo? <laughs> Man, this, this 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 started off as a delivery service in Tallahassee. Oh, Go wow. Rattlers. I'm a Rattler. Oh. Okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah, back in 2015, we started the de- delivery service. And uh, the delivery service was set out to deliver for um, food trucks. And we actually end up partnering with the food truck and end up uh, introducing our own concept of food and munchies, which our hours is, you know, for the college students, we got, you know, they want to eat late. late so night, we yeah. didn't even open till 6 o'clock and we used to close at 4 in the morning. Okay. And we found ourselves being one of the only food trailers delivering uh, on all major platforms. Really? We had, uh, back then it was um, uh, Grubhub didn't deliver, but we had Grubhub, E24, um, I think Uber Eats wasn't out yet, but we were also taking in phone calls and people was calling us all over the city to, to bring them Hot Box Express oh, wow. from a food truck. Yeah. So mm-hmm. from there, we, we years passed and um, end up partnering up with uh, the two local clubs in, in Tallahassee. One of them, Pop Bellies, if y'all from Tallahassee, you know Pop Bellies. And then the, the other one is GVO, mm-hmm. and okay. that's one. Yeah, so we we, we basically um, attached ourselves to the club. The club owner gave us an opportunity for, to provide food for those who go out, mm-hmm. you know. And after the club let out or doing the club, they can eat the food while they're there. And um, yeah, that's how we came about. And then you know came back home to Palmetto and, and saw an opportunity in the storefront and. Here we go today. Mm. So y'all, sure. you, Mr. Morris. Yes, sir. You from Palmetto, and you know what, Mr. Morris? Yes, sir. I um, I was racking my brain, and I said, man, I remember this kid, man. He ain't that much younger than me, but I, what I remember back in the G of you was your thick ass neck. You had a real, <laughs> you had a real thick neck, boy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. So look, man, coming back to um, coming coming back home, starting a business in in Tallahassee. Uh, Mike, you from? I'm from Pompano Beach, you uh, Broward County. Broward County. Okay, yes, okay, East Florida, East Florida, Florida, Florida boy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Coming yeah, co- yeah. coming coming back to your home, Joe, yes, uh, and and starting this Hot Box Express home. Uh, what was that process like? What was the thought process? I'm talking about. Give me the idea. T- take me through the whole thing. Um, you know, I came home, you know, basically on a trip, you know, see my mom, rest in peace, mom, just lost my mom in January 20, January 24. Rest in peace. And, uh, while, while home seeing her, you know, the opportunity arose in the plaza there. And I've all, I've been trying to get in that plaza for the last five years. Wow. And, and yeah, so 
opportunity arose this time and got in touch with the landlord and um, was able to come up with some immediately. So, you know, I wanted to make sure to be able to come home with the concept and, you know, just to be an inspiration to the community, you know, yeah. to, to those, sure. the, the, the youth in our community, they, they, they know me from the football field. And so basically, you know, I came back home to, to do something for home and, yeah. you know, to, uh, you know, give a savory taste of what we're used to growing up, even mm -hmm. at the time at the Trojan game. We, we grew up on, you know, chicken wings at the okay. concession stand. Mm -hmm. okay. uh -huh. and, and, and chicken wings and fries. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> we, we had the gizzards, we had the juice, you, you know. You know, so I just wanted to basically bring a community vibe back to the city where, where it was a void at the time. So yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Coach Coach Vic said congrats thank you coach man. and 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 my cousin hey mad wood one thing i ain't gonna do is leave you out boy if i see you comment cuz i'm gonna make sure i say it cuz say man tell joe i said what's up man he proud of you man mad wood is proud of you all right now um now you wanted to bring you wanted to bring something back to your community um what like the, the 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 entire menu. Now, when y'all when you were coming up with the with, with the menu, what were you trying to say? Like, man, we want to have this for these certain type of people, or what's right, happening? Right. When we came up with the menu, we we didn't want to leave anybody out, and and we're still developing the menu to to incorporate everyone. Um, but we know everyone. One most majority of our neighborhood. I, I grew up right in the neighborhood where where, where the business is at. And I know we eat chicken. I knew we couldn't go wrong with chicken. And, and then I know that there's, you know, people that are moving more on a, on a vegan note or yeah. some vegetarians, you know. We wanted to make sure to incorporate the veggie options and the vegan options where we have our wraps. And then we also have our, our nachos that are vegan and vegetarian. Um, and then we also wanted to have a sweet tooth with the with the with, with the funnel cakes and the and the fried Oreos. We grew up in Palmetto, Bradenton, Sarasota, going to the Manatee County Fair yeah. right down the road. So mm -hmm. we wanted to fill that void for you know the, that 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 crave that we have yeah. mm -hmm. for waiting on the fair. We got to wait <laughs> on the fair, you know, to come once a year for two weeks. And, and we pay to get in really just to go eat, you yeah. know. So that's what we kind of wanted to have a broad menu for everybody to enjoy. Uh, we're working on bringing in fish right now. We're working on bringing in those pork chop sandwiches. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, working on bringing in Uncle John Saji. And, and that, was, that was one of our customers came in the other day. I, I don't know if he's listening, Mr. Lorenzo, um, you know, came in and said, you, you can't forget about them. Type thing. That's why we got the gizzards on there too, because yeah. you know, growing up, yeah. you know, the older heads ate the gizzards, but mm -hmm. and they coming in there saying, "Oh, y'all got gizzards," and yeah. I don't, I don't know where in Palmetto it may be places <laughs> in Palmetto where you can get gizzards from, but Man, ain't nowhere in Palmetto. Ain't nowhere. Now, 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 speaking, now speaking to that, did you do a little market research because, like, when I moved to Palmetto like three years ago, yes, sir. My first thought in my head was. It wasn't no Popeyes there, you know what I'm saying? Right, 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 right. I said, man, the chicken spot would be on point over right, there, right, man, right now. You right. know what I mean? Then Popeyes showed up. Right. So did did y'all do any like market research, like in the area, to see like is anybody frying chicken or is anybody you know doing anything? You you feel me? Absolutely, we we did. I I, I remember growing up and there was a, a KFC in town. Right. Yeah, okay, you used to I be a that. KFC in town, and <laughs> and and, real, and and now that you know we've gotten old and that gone to come back there's no kfc yeah, no and right, so right. yeah we did a, a, we did do our research on that's real what where can we fill the void at and, yeah. and it was right in the middle of the city mm -hmm. that's what's up i can drink that <laughs> <laughs> Birthday, and, and, who birthday? And, 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 and happy oh. St. Patrick's Day. Oh, ha yeah, happy St. Right, 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 right. Patrick's Day. Oh, you got no green. Oh, yeah, I, got no green. I got no green. I ain't got no green. Only thing green on me is my tattoo ink and my money. So I get to pinch y'all and y'all owe me like $10, right? <laughs> 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 uh, 
uh, Mr. Uh, Irving. What's up? Now, coming down to Manatee County, uh, is this, uh, are you familiar with the area or you, you came with, you Joe? How, how, how did y'all hook up anyway? Uh, yeah. yeah, we hooked up um, back in Tallahassee. We actually uh, met each other through fitness, yeah. uh, actually, you know, with Zip Sweat. Uh, basically, he owned, uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to move the microphone like so we can hear you. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. I'm a little crazy. It's all good. We good. We good. It's all good, man. We good. Man. That's your cup. Yeah. Throw that ice out. I I I I make you cup. I make you another cup. Go ahead. So we um we had met through uh through fitness through hip sweat. And um, so as soon as I met him, you know, something had told me, like, you know what I'm saying, this guy, you know what I'm saying, he always, he gives back, you know, he, uh, he showed me a lot of love um, starting out, and uh, he taught me things, you know, things that I was trying to do, especially in the fitness, in the fitness industry, and uh, we started working together and stuff like that right there, and um, like Zip said, this one of the things, these are the pants, the, um, the shirt at the house, but if y'all can see it, you know what I'm saying? That, that, that like that's a brand? Zip. It says yeah, that's, that's that's a fitness brand. Brand. That's, that's a zip that's sweat. Brand. Okay, brand. okay, 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 let's do it. Zip sweat. Yeah, yeah zip sir. sweat. Okay. It started out with zip sweat, we had for how we first met. But, um, and then he had came to me one day and he was asking me that I was, was I interested in um, uh, investing into a restaurant. It was a different name at the time. At the time, I think it was other one, nachos. And I was like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because I had already been working with him. I already see how, um, like, uh, working in the clubs. We was over, we was over at um, FAMU one time, too. We did a lot of work over at FAMU. And um, I basically seen, like, seen, like, our opportunity in the industry, in the, in the restaurant industry. You know what I'm saying? Because... I look at it, I go in places, I see places that are so corporate, you know what I'm saying? You don't yeah. you don't feel like home in there, you know what I'm saying? You just feel like right. coming there and you pay and you, you have a long way of not, nobody really show you really like they really care or know yeah. you. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I feel like we had that feel, you know what I'm saying, that we could bring to the rest of our industry and that, that's what like, you know what I'm saying, that's what kind of, that's what differentiate us, differentiate us. And uh, we bring that energy too as well. You know what I'm saying? When you out there, you get that vibe. You know what I'm saying? When you out there, we got the music playing. When you coming in there, Word. we got you know what I'm saying? Excellent customer service. Friends. You know what I'm saying? If you wait too long for your food, you know what I'm saying? We'll accommodate you with a lemonade or something like that. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But um, yeah, we uh, we it's 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 a bright future over here. And then when I got here, I was like, oh, man, it's, it's, it's like the people, like, they show so much love, you know what I'm saying? Especially everybody come for them probably either know him or, or know somebody that know him, you right. know what I'm saying? So yeah. I just see, like, you know what I'm saying? I see all the love. And uh, over there in the Snappers Plaza, like y'all mentioned before, you said there's no food over there. And I noticed that. It's actually people, uh, a few people that was in that same spot that sold food, but they didn't really last long. Um, but, yeah, I, I seem like. The one thing I did notice that we do different that they didn't do is our marketing. You know what I'm saying? Like on the ins like on the inside of the place, it was just great. When I first walked in there, it was just all great. And that's what it had been through all those people that was there before us. Right. And I was like, man, when you walk in here, you won't get no restaurant vibe in here. Who yeah. Right. I, like, who yeah. gonna sit out in here and just, it's great everywhere. Yeah. The food can be spectacular, but it's just like, <laughs> the atmosphere. I eat this mm -hmm. at the high. Yeah. Oh, well, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, um, but so the first thing, um, the first thing I did was like, man, let's paint these walls, you know what I'm saying? Make it get put, you want colors that can make people hungry or make people want to eat, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, you just or at least vibe, be able to vibe, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Feel comfortable, feel right. at home, right. And then also, like the sign, is it y'all seen it when y'all walked it? Like in the plaza, you see the big sign that's mm -hmm. under the. Hot box. We, yes, sir. We, we haven't seen somebody put that up right there. Hot like, box. As far as like promoting and stuff like that. Really? Right? Yeah. Like, yeah. We got we we coming in a different way. You know, like a different. You know, we doing stuff kind of like different. Yeah. When it comes to you know this restaurant stuff, you know, like I say, we ain't say we come to take over, but 
we finna like we want to disrupt the restaurant industry, especially yeah. you know what I'm saying, what we at right now. Yes, sir. Because, yes, sir. You know, now, who came up with the name? How did the name Hot Box Express come about? And, like, what does it mean? Y'all had to have a reason behind naming it the Hot Box. Somebody's smoking. <laughs> That's all I want to say. Somebody's smoking. Somebody's smoking. We all remember. Yes, sir. <laughs> but yeah, man, it, it, the concept came with Monchies, of course. Mm -hmm. You know, college town. Mm -hmm. You know what time it is? Six to four a.m. Yep. Food delivery. Nobody open but Waffle House and CBS. Okay. <laughs> 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 yeah, food nowhere. So yeah, so probably uh -huh. you know, and, and you already know it's you know you say hot box. Come on now. You ain't naive. Yeah. So it's catchy, you know, you yeah. catch you off yeah. guard. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Hot box. Hot box. Yeah, so hot box. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And on the other hand, it's commercial. Too. It's oh, commercial. Yeah. Yeah. for real now. For real now. Y'all yeah. know anybody that do commercials? Because we actually need somebody that like do commercials for us. Because somebody that's We swell, do commercials. Yeah, swell, yeah, say, say, hey. Okay. Oh, Tap oh, in. Oh, oh, please call the hot box. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. And that's one of the things too, man. We want to have fun with this. We we actually want to franchise this thing. From within the hood, yes, you know, yes, not the hood. We we is the hood at yeah. the end of the day, yeah. but the, the, our neighborhood. That's what right, we call right, our right, neighborhood. Right. The hood. Mm -hmm. you know? So we we definitely want to, you know, branch out. This is our first storefront with with Hot Box. So you know, we really want to have fun with it. We really want to make it welcoming. We we don't want to really change the feel. You know, we, we our target, you know, markets is is, is going to be neighborhoods. You know, yeah. we want to be in the neighborhood. Yes, you know, a lot of times we get, you know, some 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 of us have arrived and we end up, you know, leaving where yeah where know, greatness started. Where greatness started. So we don't want to do that. We want to pinpoint, you know, neighborhoods. You know, that may not have the you know convenience of a, a of a Popeyes in the neighborhood. It may not have the convenience of churches chicken. May not have the convenience yes, of KFC, and we can, you know, provide this, you know, you know, food right in the neighborhood, and and you got your own options. We also we also do smoothies in there, you know, real fruit smoothies. So if you, if you ain't in the mood for chicken, you know, you can get you a real fruit smoothie, and if you want to add some protein in there, you can work out, come in there, and, and get you a protein shake as well. So. Oh, y'all got it all covered. Y'all got it all covered. Yes, sir. Got the bases covered. Um, who is in the back cooking? Oh, man. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Listen, 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 man. Who in the back? You in the back? You in the back. Who in the back cooking? I'm, I'm in the back. I'm in the back. Okay. Okay. So everything that comes out of the Hot Boss Express got to have... That's right. That that's everything right. that's fried. Everything that's fried. <laughs> everything. <laughs> 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 to the, to the, that cup, well, actually, that's everything. That's everything. Yeah, yeah, every single yeah, thing. Yeah, I got, yeah, I got yeah, at least make it prepared for him to finish it off. But an Oreo, he didn't you have one, man? <laughs> <laughs> hey, the Oreos, we had the Oreos at Super Bowl. Oh, my goodness. Mm. Yeah, what do you love at, 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 at the Super Bowl? In Tampa? Yeah, we did. So, so did y'all post up with y'all? Yeah, we posted up. up. We was right yeah, we was up cooking. Yeah, yeah we, 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 up. we was right across from, um, like literally right across from the stadium. To the stadium. Oh, yeah. straight yeah. up. Oh, yeah. man. So how was that experience, though, man? Oh, how man. was it? Oh, man, yeah. bro. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have enough people to help yeah, was, serve that. Oh, thing. okay. That's okay. what it yeah. came down to. Now that's dope. We didn't have enough people. Yeah, like, wow. you know what I'm saying? Everybody working, everybody doing two, three things at a time. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Now, now, that was one of the things, too, man. We know we, you know, at home, you know, everybody home know what good food tastes like. Yes, mm -hmm. You know, so it's a lot of, you know, making sure the critique is on point. Yeah, yeah. Woo! You know, yeah. making sure it's real. Yeah, you gotta we be delivering, real. Yeah. you know. Seriously. You know, quality. Every single time. Because yeah. you, can't you, can't, you can't slip up. You can't. You slip up. You can't. And, you know. Especially at home because they will Ooh. let you know about it. They let you know. Now, um. Uh, <laughs> Now, now y'all have had a few critiques. I mean, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I I come and visit y'all enough to where we talk enough, and you know, uh, 
you, we, we, I, I've heard of the few critiques. Tell the people about the few critiques that you have um, encountered and how you actually resolve or, 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 have, or come up with a solution to anything someone critiques. Uh, one, of, one of the, uh, I, I remember one offhand, and I'll be very transparent with it. We was uh, in there one night and uh, getting ready to close, and we had, it was a, it was, un, well, not all the way underdone, but it was some chicken that could have cooked a little longer. The lady came and told us, right? Mm -hmm. And so we was like, no hard feelings. We want to know that. You know, yeah. We don't, no, 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 no. don't want to not, you know, <laughs> yeah. deliver right, you know, because, you know, some people, she didn't have to come tell us. She could have went and just talked about yeah. us. Yeah. And, yeah. 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 So, so, so we I immediately said, hey, give me that food back, back and we going to make it over. She said, oh, you don't got to do that. No, we got to do that. You know, yeah. we going to do yeah. that. And, you yeah. know, so that was one of the answers. And, and, and so, that t that taught taught us the lesson. Like, hey, we ain't. There's no rush. And, and I know sometimes. And, and y'all, please forgive us. I know our customers come in there. And another thing, we just got a, another fryer in addition to the other ones that we had. So the wait time um, has cut has, down has a lot. Cut down. Oh, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> trust me. Trust me. And, and, I know. <laughs> and, 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 and the thing with the wait, everybody, is that we do drop everything to order. So we don't, we don't, we don't just have stuff in the window sitting up. We want everybody to have a fresh experience. Yeah. You know when sure. they come with in. With that, with that, with that being said, because I know when he ordered all this stuff right here, we know by the end of the night we have to cook it, right? But what happened was I ended up cooking it, but I felt like once I cooked it, it had nothing got too cold. I cooked a whole nother fresh one. Oh, I had to cook a whole nother fresh one. So you like, wasted yeah. food for hey, us. Salute that, man. Because I, I want to give y'all a good, you know, what I'm saying that good experience. You know Definitely what I'm salute that. Well, let me get one of these nachos right here. <laughs> Let's not let them sit any longer. <laughs> you understand me? <laughs> Whoa, hey people. People, this is the Southwest Nachos, Church Easy style, with no pickles and no salsa on it. And we just got uh, jalapenos and everything else that come on the Southwest Nachos. Yeah. So y'all make sure y'all get down there and get them. I eat these bitches almost every day. Hey, <laughs> 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 hey that ain't no, ain't like I say, no cap. But I come in there every day and get these bitches. Yeah. <clears throat> said the chicken sandwich was good. Okay, um, okay. Yeah, she said, hi, I missed this. Awesome. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and we are planning an a, a actual grand opening for the community. Oh, yeah. That's what um, we need. Right now, we are in the soft opening phase, you know, but we are planning a whole parking lot event, you know, you know hopefully Big Dog will come out there. Uh-oh, uh-oh, yeah, there, you yeah, there you go. There you go. We can hook it up, Yeah, yeah, we can hook it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, oh, we know. Yeah, 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 for real, now. So when the time comes, we'll definitely make sure the community know, you know, so, when that when that big grand opening is. Right now, yeah, we're working yeah. out the tweaks, trying to make sure we're delivering y'all food in a in a timely manner. Mm -hmm. Now, the, one of the secrets is this, you know, call in if you don't want to really yeah. wait. You can call in. We'll have that food ready for you mm -hmm. upon arrival. But, you know, please do it. If you don't know the number, pull out your phone right now. Yeah. Uh-oh, okay. uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. get in right now. How oh. about says press call in number oh, for your order? Okay. All right. What's that uh -huh. number? 941-212-4070. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> zero seven zero. okay, let me okay, call that, that number. Log that in your phone One, one more time. Now. One more time. Pull your phone out. Pull your phone out now. Go to your contacts. All right. Okay. But you log this number in your phone. You ready? You got it? <laughs> 941 212 4070. Yes, sir. That's it right there. Hot Box Express. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta lock that in too. And then, yeah. and then look, and then after you do that, you set your alarm. Set your alarm for about 2 30 p.m. <laughs> <laughs> it's lunch time. <laughs> Call hot bar, make that order. Please. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. And, and to those who have been waiting on the ribs, <laughs> we got two racks in for sample tomorrow. Okay. Get in there, order them. 
Okay. Real juicy, real hot, juicy. We smoke. We pop not, out with not, a, not grill smoke with a, off the fire. Off the oh, off the fire. So off they the fire. When you so bite into it, you know, okay. Okay. my real smoke. Know what I'm talking about? Or the or the or the grill. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> now, um, as, as far as the, the the vision and where you guys expect or aspire to go with the Hot Box Express, where is it? We definitely want to start baby steps, but we know our broad vision. So, you know, we definitely want to expand here locally. You know, we want to probably another location right over the bridge in Bradenton. Okay. Uh, somewhere. Or, or a few. Um, Sarasota. Okay. Of course, we get this area here to help us propel to other big cities, mm -hmm. you know, and, so. and to... Really, it started from here, you know. It started right here, uh, from here, you know. This is where I'm from. And then here. After this, we're going to Pompano. That's what That's I said. It. Okay. We're going Word. to Pompano. Word. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Same concept, same thing we brought from Tallahassee. You know what I'm saying? Bragging the hill. Yeah. And then we're going to keep it going. Yeah. We're going to keep it going. Pompano Beach! You know it. Uh, is yeah. it Pompano Beach or just it's Pompano? Pompano Pompano Beach, Brown County, Florida, okay. 954. Okay, <laughs> okay, <that>. okay. <laughs> now, when y'all were doing this in Tallahassee, how different was it? Like, I mean, I know well, you had kids, you know, woo. calling all time of night. Oh, but. man. Those were some long nights. Yeah. Long nights. At the club? Yeah. 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 Long nights. And then you even see? even the original, you know, the, the 4 a.m. calls, you know, them folks was really calling in yeah. for yeah. some food. And we, we, we literally had a real good style, you know, driving deliveries out that type of morning from a food truck. So, so this was literally before Uber Eats. This oh, way all that, all, all that, that, all that. that. It's like, it's we, like we, 05? We were, wow. sometime uh, like. 2015. Not I'm talking about 2015. <laughs> 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 That's an 05. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> We're 2015, so yeah, okay. That's what I meant. I meant 1-5. 1-5. Uh, uh, yes, sir. 1-5. Let them know, big dog. 1-5. 1-5. 1-5. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Now, uh, what was the vision for the Hot Box Express? Yeah. 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 When you came up with this concept and it started working, um, how was that process like? When like, okay, sh shit, this bitch working. Like right. this, this shit. Hey, we gotta do something. We gotta do something to to, to get these people their food faster or, or something. Cause that was uh, revolutionary. All also, uh, getting in front of DoorDash and, and Uber Eats and also uh, uh, delivering food. So, like, where did that the whole idea come up? The original idea. Like the like we gonna shut that we gonna stay open we gonna answer the oh, yeah, phone yeah, at yeah, four yeah, o'clock yeah, in the yeah, morning. In the morning, yeah, because we was at a college town. College students ain't sleep, and, and you know yeah. we even delivered to Strozier Library at Florida State. Go nose, yes sir. You know, we it, it, no one sleeps there, so everybody's yeah. you know got tests, got homework. You know, so we wanted to fill that void wherein everybody was closed, but they can count on hot box. Mm. You know, half of them was, had, yeah, half of them had already hot box. But <laughs> 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 we got there, I didn't realize we were still open. Mm. Yeah. We pulling up at the library, you know, we pulling up at dorms where the, the caf cafeteria closed. So, yeah, that's that's where it, that's where it came from. And this is like you said before. The the other third party delivery service we was manually delivering mm -hmm. ourselves, you know. Right, right. And, and to and to uh, big dog, uh, uh, what difference from from there to here? Right. The difference is the standards. <laughs> you know, <laughs> we are, you, you, this is a community vibe here where you got you know. Yeah, yeah. For the college, y'all yeah, we, we got time. drunk yeah. college students. You know, so, you, yeah, you might clear. be able to slip up, but. Yeah. You know, not that we slip up anyway on purpose, but right. here you, hey, you got to do everything. Dot your eyes, cross your teeth yeah. twice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. 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 Sometimes we, y'all don't see us behind yeah. the curtain yeah. back there, but yeah. I, yeah. I said, he said, I said, that ain't going. That ain't right. <laughs> you know, we don't make sure it's right, you know, mm -hmm. before, before 
anybody get it. So, and it's a good thing, you know. And, and I'm glad to, to hear the uh, hands as well, to hear the feedback. We need to hear the feedback because the feedback is what's going to keep us in business, what's going to get everybody quality service and good food. You know? yes, so have you guys started a Facebook page or any social media? Yes. yes. We, yeah. So because we're supposed to have live, have our Facebook <laughs> live right now. I think we got everybody to hold it. That's why I put it on the <laughs> stand. I don't know how to yeah, yeah. So you could have posted it somewhere in here, man. You ain't. Yeah. <laughs> it's all good, so is a Make it work. <laughs> so, I mean, like, as two black men starting a business and a community business, you guys did your research, you wrote the vision, and that's been a constant throughout tonight, is the importance of that vision. What do you guys tell other young people about writing that vision? How did that vision look for you guys when you wrote it? Uh, yeah, I mean, well, I would say this. Um, whatever that you, whatever goal you're trying to reach in life or whatever dream you're pursuing, I just say don't give up. You know, even if it look like some things, you might not have everything in place how you might want it, don't stop. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, if you stop, sometimes that might be right when you had that break. You know, you know what I'm saying? It may look ugly to you. You know what I'm saying? It may, be, it may look ugly to others right now. But like you said, as long as you had that vision and, you know, and keep your eye, keep focus on it, don't let nothing stop you. You'll get there. You'll make it work. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. We have not. Like, you know, we, we took that leap of faith. We took that opportunity. We, we you know, we ran it with it. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Nah. And, 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 and for me, Ben, from here, you know, I, I boast greatly on where I'm from, you know, and, and you know, growing up in the community and, and Pat Matter Boys and Girls Club. I even had time at East Braden Club right over by the Pirates Field, you know, Coach Chuck. You know, uh, right. God, Daddy. <laughs> that's where I remember you from right now. That's where I remember you from. Louis you know. Yes, sir. You know, all, uh, I forgot uh, what's going on the name, but Coach Chuck, uh, when you know I'm talking about. Um, uh, Lenita? Lenita, yes. Yeah. Shout out to Lenita. Shout out to Miss Lenita. But, you know, it, for me, you know, growing up and, and, and being, being a mentor as I was in high school, you know, even to the little kids coaching, you know, little league basketball, you know, faced off versus some of the, you know, legendary, you know, little league coaches in town, Coach Clint Mitchell mm. and um, uh, other other coaches that was at. And, you know, y'all remember Championship Friday, you mm -hmm. know, you yes, know we used to, I used to be involved with that and to see the youth, you know, I was in, I was a youth myself, but I always found myself and and my parents would tell you, I used to coach. I used to coach some of them. I don't know if I rocked them. <laughs> but, but, but I'll, I'll admit that now. Nah, but but it, it, some of them was a, a few months younger than me, but I was still a coach out there. Yeah, exactly. But to see them, you know, and to see the little kids grow up and you can be a a, a, a mentor and, and, and they look up to you, you know, that's what we want to deliver here. We want, we want, we want, name brand out of this city which it is this city yeah. this mm -hmm. this county very 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 name brand a lot of people know people like look at coach taggart right now and, and, and right. coach woody you know and, and and other i can go the list can go on and on i y'all were just in here with a legend yes you know, sir with yeah, right. you, feel me? You, you know peter ward you, you can delete trion i know trion and congrats to trion seriously man i, I love the neon by the way, on that the Dion Tesla, <laughs> <laughs> that loud ass show, Tesla. Man, I love it. Hey, we were leaving the car show. I was with OG Madden, man, in Tampa. And I, as we was leaving, I seen Trion come in. I said, man, we should have stayed. I, he, he he probably won the thing by just coming in there with the car. You know what I'm <laughs> well, <laughs> well, he need to turn the volume down on, right? Really? <laughs> but yeah, to, 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 we want to see, you know, I personally want to see this youth in the future, you know, and, and to enhance our community with people from here, you yeah. know, mm -hmm. and, and and we put our own money back into the community, you feel me, and yeah. to uplift our, our own youth, our own neighborhoods, and, and empower our own kind, you know. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now, um, you, you have uh, all these smokers. 
You have all these smokers that fill up Manatee County, Sarasota County. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have uh, uh, also a, um, a restaurant called Munchies. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Awesome. That's what's up. Oh, y'all didn't know about Munchies? Know munchies. Nah. 420 Munchies. 420, 420, 420 Munchies. It's in Sarasota. Sarasota. Right. I heard about right. it. Right. All right, all right. Yeah. Yeah. Way, yeah. way yeah. out there. Yeah. We don't want to motherfucker go all the way out there to get none of this shit. South, south, south. A good south. 30, 40. Oh, 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 from Hill, from Hill, no, good, no shit, bro, about, what, 20 minutes? 20 minutes at least. I heard, I heard about at least. About it. At least. This so, 20 minutes from where we was at, so it can't be too much for Nah, oh, Palmetto closer. It feels closer. Yeah. Yeah. It feels yeah. closer. Yeah. Yeah. It feels closer. And this considered Man Manitou. Yeah, Miss Manitou. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ain't really deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess you know that one. So, so, so yeah. just like that restaurant, I'm not trying to give y'all say, oh, y'all need to be like somebody else. But, you know, smokers, we have a different time, type of taste when we get high. Yeah. You want to put uh, chips on a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. so with y'all menu, will y'all cater to more of that high feeling or that high munchy feeling or that, that you know, that high hungriness? Or you going to... <laughs> Come back with that, bro. They got they got a peanut butter hamburger sandwich, bro. Like Damn. peanut, peanut butter, butter hamburger, hamburger sandwich, bro. salmon. Damn. Oh, really? oh, matter of fact, it's a peanut butter and jelly. Hamburger sandwich. No, I ain't eating. Somebody, whoever had that, y'all tap into the live and let us know how that tastes. I know I had some macaroni and cheese on the motherfucking hamburger that they had down there. Okay, okay. Man, that bit was good. Fries and on the hamburger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Burrito and a Yes, sir. We got something for you. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Okay, okay. That's what I'm trying to figure out, man. Y'all expanding on. And look, it's to the community, man. Y'all shoot us some ideas. Yeah, yeah. Suggestions. Yeah. Suggestions. We got a Facebook, uh, Facebook. What it is? Hot boss express. Pop up. Yeah. So y'all want to leave reviews? Or... And matter of fact, that we gonna do it next month. Next month we yeah. don't have a community suggestion drawing, and whoever win the drawing, we got we gonna premiere you on the menu. Okay. 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 A community. Give us that again. Give us that again, Joe. Give us that again. That drop a ball. <laughs> For that shit, that yes, sir. <laughs> next next month, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a suggestion box, okay? For the community, for, for whatever suggestions you may have for as a menu item. And if you wanna be premiered on the hot box express menu, we're gonna do a drawing next month. Next month. If your name is if your suggestion and your name is being pulled for that menu item, you will now be on the hot box express. Okay. Ooh. Menu. Oh, wait a minute. Time out, man. Wait a minute, bro. Hold on. Wait a minute. God damn it. I feel like I want me a meal. I want one that's named after me. I need a church cheese. Okay. Can I have a church cheese? Okay. Get us that. Get us what you want. And you gonna be on the menu. church cheese. Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh, uh oh. Y'all got an idea for me? Y'all got an idea for me? Because I'm going to put some seafood up in y'all motherfucking meat. Absolutely. Mean. Okay. Absolutely. So that church cheese is going to have some seafood in it. And let's okay. go. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Hey, hey, man. Hey, hey. In the next few months, we finna have a church cheesy meal at the That's Hot Box Express. You understand me? And I get 10%. And we need, <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. And you still have a laundry by your thing, though. We need your emoji. With the church emoji? Yeah, church, yeah. Church oh, 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 my face. You need a cartoon yeah, face of me? Cartoon, yeah, cartoon. You yeah. send me your face. I, I cartoon it out. <laughs> hey man, I, hey, hey! Shout out to my, hey, you know what? I'm gonna have to give a shout out to my man Demetrius Andrews. Okay. Oh yeah, shout man. out to hey, my man real, Demetrius me, Andrews, me, man. Bro, you've been on it, bro. Thank, hey, from day one, me been in there, man. And our hearts do go out, man. We we, we love you from Hotbox. You know you support all the time, man. And, Forgive us on them waffles. We working on getting them. <laughs> we know what you love. That yeah, that's me, man. Oh, Appreciate man. Oh, man. He, been, he been showing love, man, yeah. from the first day, for real. From day one. He, he is the one who 
that I knew first that had a meal from y'all. Mm -hmm. It was like, bro, church. These <laughs> niggas had the hot box, man. <laughs> And Palmetto, bro, right next to T Green, bro. Yeah. I went to got me some chicken today, bro. Oh my god. I said, oh yeah, I gotta go check him out. I said, I met him the other day, bro, but I ain't had nothing to eat, man. I gotta go check him out. Then when I went and checked y'all, I was like, oh yeah. Yeah. I'm here. Yeah. A mainstay. I'll be here every day. So shout out to Demetrius. Meet Millie Drews. You understand me? 4100 for life. You feel me? Nah, hey, hey, me, hey, hey, me. You are not getting a, a name, a, a meal named after you, bro. That's church easy, bro. I'm sorry, bro. You did it, though. You ain't getting no meal named after you. That's okay, man. <laughs> we the best. Uh, <laughs> uh, so now, with the Hot Box Express, are y'all trying to franchise this? Because y'all got one in Tallahassee. Now you got one here. So Absolutely. franchising is the goal. Absolutely. Why? That's the way to be, man. That's, the, that's, it, that's what you, you, you know, one of our things is you want to make it big from here and that's how you do it mm. you know? a lot of people make it big doing a lot of other things and this can be you know what what, what we make it big from and others in the community make it big but we want to go with everybody we want hey if meat want one we got one for you meat let's go <laughs> <laughs> the big dog and anybody who want one for real the, the faster we grow the faster you know yeah, this thing could be McDonald's. Why not? You know. I mean? Why not? For real. Why really? not? And you got you got big you got big celebrities like um, uh, Rick Ross investing in the Wingstop. Yes, sir. You know why not yeah. Hot Box? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, so. For real. You know yeah. DJ hey, Kylie. Why yeah. not Hot Box? I got a college spot for y'all right now. Where is it? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. in Virginia. Y'all ready? Okay. For real now. Huntington, for real. Huntington, Huntington. Hey, I got my nephew Talik, man. He up there, and, um, and you know I was just scoping out the area, but right he got a college, man. It's like yeah. no chicken spot. Kind of like, dead. Let's right rock. Let's rock. Yeah, Let's man. rock. Right by That's, college, though. Yeah, for real. Yeah, for real. For real. By Marshall, ain't it? For real, Marshall. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Let's rock. Oh, yeah. For real, man. Yeah, man. For real. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Let's do it. So, <laughs> so, so, would, would that be something like of a, a, a target audience for you guys in the Hot Box Express is college students or college town? Well, you got a college town and you want to also be in the in, in the in the hood and you also want to, you know, if, you, if you're burning it down, we want to be around. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, you got a slogan right there. Like that. You burning it down. We want to be around. Yes, sir. That's a great slogan, man. Make sure you remember that shit. Now. <laughs> if you burn it down, we want to be around. Ooh, whoa. Joe, we can't want that one off, off the cuff just now. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, all right, all right. Now, now coming from Pompano. What's up? And in Tallahassee. Okay. And now down here in Manatee County. The, the 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 biggest differences between the three spots. The biggest differences between the three spots well, it's not really a difference between here and Pompano because it's the same vibe, same kind of people, same feel. This is the neighborhood. Yes, sir. It's not with you know a whole bunch of colleges in the city. Yeah. So these two, they are different of it in its own, off real. But I like this crowd though. You like this crowd better than the college town? Yeah. Why is that? Because I see, I see first of all more of my people. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It looks just like from where I come from, which is home. You know what okay. I'm saying? Up there, you get a whole bunch of different kinds of people that come through for school from everywhere. You find yeah. people from all over the world. Gotcha. You know, we even had a dude that was working with us or for us that lives in Peru. He's in Peru. He, right he's now. in Peru right now. You know what I'm saying? He came over here through, through, due, to, due to the coronavirus. He came over here and was working with us. Uh -huh. And then you know, he, he got, he got, um, he went back, you know, but. Sure. The reason why, um, I, more reason why I like it is because, um, first of all, like <laughs> people, they will pay for good food, okay, and it's like, um, it's like, long as we deliver, long as we stay consistent at what we do, I can see it growing way faster here than it would be in Tallahassee. I can see the growth for already, right? Especially being that we just got here, like it's kind of like 
it's been overwhelming and with, within the first three weeks of just opening. Right? Mm. You know gotcha, gotcha. So it really forces us to like really stay focused on what we doing because it's really no time for like not any, any sidetrack. No distractions. So it's like we always focus on the goal. You know what I'm saying? And it we it, it's getting it's growing fast. It's going so. That's what's up. Can, can, can I just say the uniqueness about our relationship? This is my brother, by the way. From yeah, another mother, yeah, man. Yeah. I'm sorry. And, um, you know, we, we, we met in Tallahassee years ago, and the uniqueness about us is, you know, he's from Pompano. But I got an auntie that live in Pompano. Right there in Pompano, my, my, where I grew up. My auntie, right? And his, my auntie lives literally. A block, a block away from from his from where he grew Bro, up at my grandma house. His, his grandma house mm -hmm. and so I didn't know him from Adam and Tally and then we went to Pompano one time I guess we were I was going to, uh, going to Pompano for Christmas yeah and he said hey I live in Pompano you know I, I think we rode together this so. man went right around the corner I said, from I'm, from my house. I'm like you live right here <laughs> you, you from Pompano you got people that from Pompano so yeah, right there. That, hey, that, that that's a beautiful thing, man. And it's crazy how the universe uh, puts that's people true. together like yeah, that. Crazy, and where you just like what what they call it, five degrees of separation. Right, right. And right. you, it's not that far off. Right. But y'all just y'all you, you get you get connected somewhere down the line, man. That shit is beautiful. That's the end. That that that's the universe, man. And I love that type of shit, man. Uh, so, for you, Mister Joe, now um, your differences between Tallahassee and home, and why and where you like it the most. Um, difference between Tallahassee and here is you know, the piggyback off he said is you're dealing with college students, which is a good thing. We, we appreciate the college students. We love the college students. But here, make you step your game up. You feel me? You got to be sharp, which is good. And one of the verses in the scriptures say, iron sharp as iron. So I got mm -hmm. Palmetto, Florida, Bradenton, Florida, Sarasota, Florida, you know, more so Palmetto. That's where I'm from. You know, it's sharpening sharpening us, you know, to make us great. You can't just, you know, be subpar. You want, I want to hear the feedback, you know, I want to hear the constructive criticism, you feel me? And so that's what it's all about. If 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 the hood is telling us where how to be critiqued, all of us is in this together. Mm -hmm. You feel me? And so and, and and if if y'all are critiquing us, then we all moving together. Because if, if I'm from the hood, y'all critiquing me, we get, go global with this thing. I'm a Palmetto citizen. You feel me? And, and so y'all and we all proud together. Did y'all think oh, did Obama know he was gonna be president? He, I don't know if he did or not. Did he want to be president? Yes, he wanted to be president. Did he become president? Yes, he did. Wherever he came from, he was from. You feel me? And mm. so mm -hmm. that whole city was the president. Right, 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 right. You, right, 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 right. you see what I'm right. saying? So that's what it's all about to me. And that's the difference. I love being home. You know, I, 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 I really do. I've been gone for a while and I'm back. And I, I always love from, and I've always had big aspirations, you know, from what, for, for where I'm from. And you, mm -hmm. so, and we going I, I foresee Palmetto being, you know, big time. You know, they they, they they building up right now. I'm not naive to the development that's happening right now. Um, the the, the I, I foresee downtown being a real downtown pretty soon, you know. And and those if you're black, if you you look like us, you know, and, and shout outs to the Hispanic group, they stick together, you know, and, and so can we, you know, if we can Develop Palmetto how we want. Don't let nobody run you out your place. You, know, mm -hmm. your city, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Stay put and, yeah. and, 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 and build your own stuff up. A lot yeah. of us get money and, and lead the lead the hood. Why not enhance the hood? That's where I'm at with it. You see what I'm saying? And, and even with downtown Palmetto, I foresee skyrises there. We're too close to the water. You know, eventually we're gonna Woo. be a big time city, and, 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 and we want to be. 
You know, in place. In place. Big dog, ain't this the shit I've been saying? Yes, sir. This is the s- <laughs> Joe, bro, I ain't never had no conversation with you about this shit. Me and Big Dog and Mel, we have conversations about this all That's the crazy. time. That we, as business owners, yeah. entrepreneurs, and us as media people, yeah. and just as, as inhabitants of this place, we have to build it up more. That's going to make people come from fucking Atlanta. Right. And yeah. bring their ass down here, right. cause we got we got all the type of uh, environment that you would really want to see. All the water you can have. All the water you yeah. can have. Yeah, the best yeah. weather on earth. Yeah. Like, yeah. why wouldn't you want to be in Sarasota, Bradenton, Palmetto? Yeah. We ain't but five minutes from the water wherever you at. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? From the from 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 the best experience that you can have living. And we right down the road, you know. A bit, a, a bit. Secret and for me coming home frequently now is is even Clearwater Beach, man. Beautiful. I did not know yeah. that place was like that. Beautiful. Man. I don't need to go back to Miami Beach. I love Miami Beach. I love South Beach. Mm-hmm. But to see the ambiance in Clearwater, right, man, right. If you tell them I go, I'm getting the Congo to clear one in the heart. I love Clearwater. <laughs> <laughs> for real, man. And I and, and I think it's on us. People like you guys. People like us, people like the, the 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 good art, the great artists that we have here. People like the promoters that we have here. Absolutely. To um to kind of cause more of an attraction right. to this area, and stop people, stop running to Atlanta, yeah. and thinking you're gonna make a better life for yourself because you're, you're, right. you're not. You're not at all. And there's things in Atlanta that. It's just whack and the shit down here that right. we got that Atlanta ain't got, and they want to come down here. Enhance your own, man. And Enhance I, your own. And I love this right here, man. I yes, really sir. do love this turkey. Yes, right. sir. <laughs> I don't know your name. Yeah. Mel, Mel. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, yeah, it's too real. This, 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 this real, like, for real, man. This is what it's all about, man. Appreciate that. And you're doing it home. You feel what I'm saying? We're doing, doing it right home. Here. Ain't no ain't no sense of running away and starting no hot box. Not before you got one down here. Ain't no yeah. sense of running away and saying, oh, we're going to start a hot I'm going to start a hot box in, in Atlanta or Washington, yeah. D.C. Yeah. Or, or some <laughs> bullshit like that. <laughs> no, but start it at home. Yeah. Yeah. And, 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 and go, we're going we gonna, to uh, 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 expand the Pompano. Yeah. He, got, he, he got some yeah. shit at yeah. home, yeah. man. Yeah. And then people are going to come from these different places and want to gravitate towards this great shit yeah. that we have down here. But we have to have this confidence in them and believe in ourselves that we are the shit because we the shit down yeah. here. Hey, look, yeah, if from Florida, if you from Florida, yeah. I always say from Bradenton or uh, 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 Palmetto to 941, but we got a Pompano man in here right now. If you from Florida and we go anywhere in the United States, we stand out. Absolutely. Why the hell are we going to run to these places where we stand out? Yeah. To, to to go to why do we gotta have these motherfuckers come us. down here right they supposed to be catching our vibe and, and want to come get our soak up all this good ass shit down here so yeah. when y'all when, when you say stuff like that that puts a you know uh sounds like music to my motherfucking ears mm-hmm. like bro you on the same shit that me mel and big dog on and some of our other people who are uh in, in, in entertainment or in right. business we own that shit so i'm glad you own that shit bro and i'm i, I love that shit man thank you very much for just, just for, for putting me up like that you, you, you filled me with joy you filled me with joy just then man <laughs> yes sir mel yeah, like I'm, I'm amazed. I love seeing black men working together. I don't think we see enough of that. Um, and you guys should definitely be out there in the community. Uh, big props to that. Thank yeah. you. Thank you for coming back home because a lot of people don't come back home. Right, right. What you know? You said your mother passed just recently, and right. I'm sorry to hear about that. Thank you. Did that play a major decision in coming back home? Absolutely. You know, that was the magnet to hey and. I, I need you to come back, and, and for me, coming back as frequently as I did, that made me realize I need to come back, for real. Like, you saw a need. I saw a need to come back, and, you know, and, that, yeah, so definitely that, that did, and um, there's, there's been other stuff, you know, and we gonna, we gonna be good. We gonna be good. I, I was able to even, doing the George Floyd um, 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 stuff that happened yeah you know i don't know many people know it was a week we, we planned it so fast but it, it happened 
we were able to be a part of some great, you know, a, a great walk over the Manatee County Bridge from Bradenton to um, Panamato, you know, with a walk, you know. That, I, I, so I've been coming back home frequently for a while. For so a while yeah. since then, you know, we, we were able to, I, I called the mayor, we, we be doing some stuff sometimes. <laughs> we called the mayor and, and told him, hey, we're coming to do a, a, a peaceful demonstration and we would like for them to be in attendance. And and, um, and we made it happen to make a long story short. Me and the team, uh, Coach Rod Martin, Miss Bailey, um, um, Chantel Norman, I, I believe that's your last name. We got on the phone quick. I didn't know these people from Adam. I got kind of got in, in the mix with Coach Martin. And he knew some people that wanted to do some similar things, so we made it happen within a week. And and it was about 1,500 people out to a demonstration for George Floyd. So yeah. there's there's a need for a lot of, lot more of that energy. And I think you know those who have the energy, you know, should spark spark the fire sometimes. Yeah. Right. Know, and yeah. get 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 this thing going. Not to say that. Others don't have, you know, the spark. Sometimes you just gotta light, light the fire. Light the fire. You know? it's, so, it's on. It's on us. It's, it's, on, it's, us. it's on people like y'all. Yeah. People like us. People like the 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 great artists that we do have. You know, and and the other great entrepreneurs that we have, whether they're in credit repair Absolutely. or or, or restaurant, right. anything, is right. it's on us because right. we're from here, right? And we're supposed to care about this place, right? And if we don't, then who is going to do it? Right. So yeah, it's really on us. The people who have, I don't, I don't want to sound arrogant, the people right. who have a, a a certain type of status or a, 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 a certain type of a number of people listen to us or something right. you have right. something to contribute to the masses right. it's on us right. to 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 make the changes and, and and make this shit what we want it to be absolutely you understand and, me and, and so i'm shout glad out i'm out proud to, of you the t green too shout out to t green <laughs> because <laughs> yes sir shout out to t green For real, he, he's been a very great motivator very great mentor man and I've been going to T Green since yay high, and, and, and he's still still there. And he give us words of encouragement all the time, man. And, hey, Joe, just and Kale, just stay focused, stay consistent. You know, he one of his favorite slogans is, is I, "I may not be the be the best, but I'm, I'm good." Yeah. Uh, he said, <laughs> "Well, you know, he know what I'm yeah, talking yeah, about." Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, it's so it feel good to have that home feel, you know, and mm -hmm. and to be back home and. Um, definitely to make mom proud. I definitely wanted, um, I, you know, I, I knew the condition she was in and I was pressing fast to um, try to make this happen before she left us, but uh, she's smiling. She's that's smiling. good. That's she's good. You know that. You, yeah, that's, that's, what, that's what's happening. Now, um, <clears throat> when it comes to, are you a, are you a chef? Since you in the back cooking, <laughs> since you in the back preparing everything, are right. you a chef? Are you are you somebody who just knows how to very who cook very well and and and, and can make some money off of it? <laughs> cooking is a science. Okay. It is a science. Um, I learned cooking from my grandma. You know, way back when, I remember my grandma used to tell us like, because her friend used to come over, Miss uh, Miss Hazel. And she used to brag a lot on, like, on her grandbabies and stuff like that. And I remember my grandma used to, uh, she used to like, tell her, her friend, "Oh yeah, my boy's in cook. My boy's finna cook, so you know." <laughs> and then, so when she say that, now nah, everybody gotta go in the, in the kitchen and pick a dish to cook. That's gonna be out there for everybody, everybody to else. eat. So you know, that's how I grew up uh, originally learning how to cook. And then you know, once I stepped into this restaurant. This restaurant industry, you know, it really brought out, you know, everything I really had in me when it, in terms of cooking, you know. Mm -hmm. I learned a lot of stuff along the way. He uh, he taught me a lot of stuff, too, you know what I'm saying, in, in, the, in the kitchen. I learned a lot of stuff from my dad. They got, um, well, him and his wife, they own a, a catering company. been having that for about six, seven years. Yeah, my brother, yeah, my brother, he, uh, he uh, 
Okay, so that's in y'all blood. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty much in the blood, you know. So it kind of comes natural to me, you know what I'm saying, in terms of like cooking and stuff like that. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. Um, hey, fellas, we running up on midnight. <laughs> so look. <laughs> So look, what, what we're gonna do is we're gonna schedule you guys to come back on a different date where preferably a Sunday when you guys are not open. Okay. And me okay. and Big Dog and Mel will go ahead and, and, and rearrange our schedule so we can have a little bit more time with you. That's awesome. Um so before we leave, give me some shout outs. Mr. Morris. I'm just I'm gonna shout out Pat Man and Home. Yeah, of course, God. I'm sorry, Lord. You <laughs> Jesus, thank, God. Thank, God. thank God, you know. And uh, Pat Metal, you know, my mom, of course. Rest in peace, Vanessa, and uh, my family. And then, of course, Pat Metal High School, class of 06, my, 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 my coach. Okay. My, my, my team, you know, we did beat Madden T. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that, was, that was a real good 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 time you know being there uh, shout out to my quarterback jesse lee bundridge you know um and the rest of the team you know uh jock you know he, he's, i'm still upset with you, you dislocated my shoulder but <laughs> appreciate you josh Mason, for helping me out that day but yeah, I'm just going. <laughs> coach haynes of course um Palmetto trojans you know lincoln all all of Palmetto family, Palmetto Boys and Girls Club, to to the whole community, man, and to also break into Pal Football League, all of y'all who has helped me um, propel through life and yeah, for, for now that's where we're at. That's what's up. That's what's up. Appreciate you for coming on, Mr. Morris. Mr. Irving. I wanna say uh, first you gotta say you gotta say thank God, you know, all for real because uh, that's like the most high. You know what I'm saying? And then you want to thank everybody that's been like a helping hand into, you know, what this thing came, how far this thing came. So, like, all the people that's working with us, you know, with Hotbox along the way, like, all of that work that they put in to help us to be here. You yep. know, we even got people that's in Tallahassee that got still going. It, that's still going for us and still with us down here. So it's like, it's, it's so, a team, so, so, you know, yes, it's not sir. just to us. You yeah. Know? We just, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of more. So I want to say like, like appreciate them guys. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, All of them, you know. Yeah. Lee, yeah. DeRay, you know what I'm saying? Nick, Jock, we were, Jock, Nick, you know. Mike. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mike was a, Mike is a yeah. good, good help, man. Help us get going. All of them. Um, we have a, a comment on here. We Hey, we the Bradshaws, Robert's people, are very proud of you two young men. Good luck in everything you do. From Raina Bradshaw, Raina Bradshaw, Raina Bradshaw. Raina Bradshaw. Yeah, that's real love, Robert. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. Appreciate y'all fellas for coming on. We're going to uh, coordinate another date on Sunday where y'all uh, finally taking y'all rest. to Y'all come on the, on the power circle and uh, hang out in a VIP and, style. And, and, and real quick, real quick, Johnny Dixon, I ain't forgot about you, man. You've been really good. You know, you and me really from the jump, y'all really um, have been on Facebook promoting us, and we do want to show our gratitude towards you as well. Johnny Dixon, I don't know if you're watching, but if you do a rewind, you'll see this. <laughs> hey, 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 man, look. Hey, my boy, Mr. Bundridge. Yes, sir. Mr. Bundridge say, hey, hey, hey Bree and I going to come by the whole menu. Okay, okay. Appreciate hey, that. Hey, Jesse, you, <laughs> hey, Jesse, you got to go tomorrow. <laughs> And buy the whole cool, menu. Yeah. Shout out, man. Hey, man. Before you do that, just call in the van. Right? <laughs> <laughs> call in the van by two hours. All right? Hey, hey, hey tell, tell the whole menu. Hey, tell Jesse Lee, uh, orange is right, gut trap right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. DJ Big Dog. Yes, sir. Shout outs. Hey, man. Shout out. Shout out to the most high. You know how really? that good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, Shout out to these fellas, man. Salute y'all, man. Appreciate Hot box that, in the building, you know. Yes, Shout out to the Power Circle, mm -hmm. 1075 The Vibe, Butt City Radio, all that, man. 941, Florida, Worldwide, my family, my wife, for everybody, I'm man. Salute, baby. Yeah. Mail, mail, mail. Shout out my son, my family, my cities. 
Okay. Um, make sure y'all check me out Monday with All Soul right. of the Matter with Mel and uh. my girl D. Cole. Uh. Um, March 27th, y'all. Okay. Poetry in the Park. Y'all oh, ain't never seen nothing okay. like that. That's okay. So make sure y'all check us out. Right. Shout out to the Power Circle 1075, the Vibe. Yeah. Like, yeah. this is real, y'all. We building over here. So I'm loving, I'm loving it. I'm loving yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all already know what time it you is with me. Yeah, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, I do I do my last, man. Y'all know what time it is with me. Shout out to my mama. Shout out to the church. Hey, shout out to my hood mix. And shout out to the whole 941 from Robonia to Venice or wherever the 941 goes. Shout out to our guest tonight, A.D. McPherson. Shout out to you, homie. Shout Thank out you. to these boys from the Hot Box Express. These men from the Hot Box Express. Boy, Mr. Boy. Joe Bolton. <laughs> Mr. Joe Bolton. <laughs> and my care, my homie, my care, Irvin, straight from Pompano. Yeah. Uh, shout out to the whole now for one man, and y'all guys. Make sure you go to www.1075thevibe.com. Check everything out. We update the website every day. Make sure you go to youtube.com slash making noise TV. That's M A K I N N O I Z E TV. And check out all the interviews we have on Making Noise TV. Make sure you guys go download that app. Buck City Radio app and make sure you stay in tune with DJ Big Dog and y'all make sure every Monday at 8 o'clock you tune in to my girl Mel <laughs> with, <laughs> with so let it matter with Mel and my girl D. Cole man um, appreciate y'all fellas for coming through and bringing through all this great food uh, shout out to the Power Circle shout out to DJ Big Dog Mel and they whole family shout out to my whole family shout out to you man love live life now for one we'll be back next week yeah. yes sir yeah <laughs> we playing music again right now <laughs> so you can so you can go back go back on the uh, website cause I'm finna end this Go back on the website, www.1075thevibe.com and go check out the music, because we playing music now. One, www.1075thevibe.com Y'all make sure y'all go, go hang out. Go fuck with me. Making noise, making noise. TV, you understand me? 1075 to FM. Buck City Radio, you understand me? Hey, free skill. Free my boy, Soldier Skip, too, man. Free my dog.